Dragon is in countdown. Dragon, SpaceX. Godspeed, go for launch. SpaceX Dragon, go for launch. T minus 30 seconds. T minus 15. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1, ignition, engines full power, and lift off. Go Crew 5. Stage 1 Alpha. Copy, 1 Alpha. Vehicle is pitching downrange. Stage one propulsion is nominal. Copy, one Bravo. Impact chill has started. You know, we have watched so many of these and it never gets old seeing that take take place. And just to let you know, in about a minute or so, we'll see the booster separation and we'll continue to watch for that. But just an amazing sight. It really is. And on a clear day, you can sometimes see those boosters coming down. Yeah, I witnessed that last that week with the uh, the Falcon 9 that went up on Friday night. It's just the, the most amazing thing to know that those boosters are going to come down and land out on a barge in the Atlantic. Uh, but just, Ryan, can you imagine the rush of emotions no, these astronauts I mean, are feeling? We talked about three of them brand new. Now, uh, one yeah. of them was a Navy pilot. Pilot, Nicole Mann. So she has gone very fast, but never has she, you know, they say they light the candle and take off like that. Never have you experienced that launch that they just experienced. Yeah, she is a uh, first time uh, commander. She is the first female to command a uh, Crew Dragon capsule. Um, and then you've got uh, the uh, Japanese astronaut. This will be his fifth mission. He's actually been up he's on done a lot space, of the space shuttle, shuttle yes, missions. Space shuttle yeah. missions, three of those. Uh, he's 59 years old, and uh, this will be. Uh, his first time up on a crew dragon. Uh, the Russian cosmonaut, I thought this was interesting. She is the only uh, female to be in service right now in the Russian space in service. the whole Russian yeah. space agency, Cosmosis, which is really pretty amazing as well. The, the views from up there are amazing. Once they get up there, there will actually be 14 humans that will be in orbit uh, because there's 11 that's going to be on the space station. There's actually three that are at the Chinese space agency. So yeah. there's going to be 14, 11 with this mission right here. Yeah, it'll be a packed 
parents' house, someone's going to have to sleep on the couch because <laughs> there will not be enough room for everybody. Hopefully, they have enough peanut butter sandwiches left, too. But uh, when they get up there, we always say it's always so much fun to watch the reunion, and that should be happening right before our 5 o'clock newscast tomorrow night. Uh, you had said, Ryan, earlier, it's a 29-hour flight 29 to get hours. there. Yeah, it is a long flight. Uh, but then once they arrive uh, at the International yeah, Space Station, of course, they open the hatch, and it's just so much fun to see everybody greeting each other and hugging and uh, everyone's together again. We're going to check in with David uh, here in a second. As we watch, if you watch the video on your screen, eventually you're going to see that landing, landing on, uh, just read the instructions. That, of course, is the cargo where they'll land in the Atlantic Ocean as we continue to watch this.